Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. So uh, YouTube Analytics is telling me that I ever on too much at the beginning of videos. So today we're going to get straight into what you're all here to see, which is another ridiculous Primark haul from me. So let's get to it. All right, so what we're going to do first of all is go through oh, this bag. So this bag has got all of the clothing that I bought and I had to buy a bag. This one has got oh, all of the accessories that I bought. Let's get yourselves a cup of tea, have a couple of biscuits for me and let's do this. Okay, so we'll start off. I have kind of sorted this stuff out um, into like tops and shorts and tricky bottoms and all that kind of stuff. So I kind of know where I'm at. So I'll kick off with this. So this is just a little, almost like a little cropped tee. Um, it cost four pounds and I got it in a size small and it's so soft. Um, love the little buttons they've got here. Um, I'm glad they're not in black actually. I think that adds a nice little detail. So just going into um, summer, I just think that this would be a great little buy. I think what I'm gonna do is um, for anything that um, I can try on, I'll try and put some clips here, there and everywhere for you just to see what stuff looks like on. So yeah, that was the first thing. The next thing then is of a similar ilk. Um, it's more of a vest, well it is, <laughs> it's a vest. Um, so this one then I got in a size small, the material is quite, um, well it's not as stretchy um, or as soft as that other one, but in terms of just as a throw on for summer, I thought it would be great. Um, like I said, I got it in a size small and this actually was only three pounds and it's got the same button detail going down the front as that one, but just in um, gray, so they kind of just matched it to the t-shirt. So yeah, good little buy, just something to throw on in the summer when you're not quite sure what to wear. Okay, next one. Next one is, okay, so this is just a small little, um, I don't know what you'd call it really, it's just a small little cropped top. Um, I only bought this because I have a lot of slouchy um, tops that like come down off one shoulder. So I just thought that this would be good to go underneath. I got mine in this one in a, 2XS. So this is meant to be um, a size four to six. So if you can imagine I got that one in a size small, which is 10 to 12, and I had to get this one in a size four to six. I don't know about the sizing, not quite sure, but just plain basic um, and it cost three pounds. Okay, got the same one, <laughs> of course I did, in white, three pounds, two times extra small. Um, this next one is a bit random for me, but I do like a bit of colour in the summer. Um, I've tried it on and it fits perfectly, but this is going to go great um, when I've got a tan. Um, simple little top, um, basic really, but um, it was in a size small again, and this one cost £4. So they've got these in quite um, a few colours. Um, blacks and whites um, and I might actually pick them up. Um, I wasn't too sure about this detail here but once you've got it on it looks absolutely fine. So again another throw on for the summer. Next we have this little tee. It's very soft actually this one. Um, I got it in a size extra small and I think this cost, yeah cost four pounds. So just a bit of a close-up. It's kind of cropped at the bottom but like I said, it's a very soft, floaty kind of material. Throw it on with shorts or when I'm on a holiday, I think I can just kind of throw this on um, in the morning just for breakfast. So yeah, a good little buy. It looks really kind of cute, that one. So I do like that one. Um, of a similar ilk, we have this one. I like the word ilk, don't I? But moving on. Um, we got this one. So this one has got little black stripes on it. Um, I got this in size small and it cost four pounds. Um, quite cropped, it's got a bit of elastic here. Um, I was gonna get the extra small, but the extra small kind of dug in a little bit. So um, I just sized up. Um, but yeah, very, very cute. Again, very 
I'm airy and floaty. Um, and yeah, a cute little bag. So yeah, happy with that one. The next one then is quite cropped. Um, I think you guys will have probably seen these because they are everywhere um, in every Primark. Um, it just says Deja Vu in navy blue writing. And I just thought it was really cute. I love the pink. Um, like I said, it is cropped again. I got mine in a size six to eight, which is an extra small. And this one cost five pounds. Again, this will be super with um, any shorts that you want to wear, high-waisted jeans, anything like that. So yeah, I really, really like that one. So, oopsie, good little buy. Right, we move on to shorts now. And I found these shorts, um, and because, well, you'll see in a minute, but they cost two pounds 50 each. And because I thought they were such a bargain, I bought four pairs. The first pair, again, is in pink. I got mine in a size small, which is 10 to 12. Now, the reason I had to get 10 to 12 is the elastic at the top is not very stretchy. Um, so, yeah. Hmm. But um, to be honest, I don't care what kind of size I buy as long as I'm comfortable in it. Um, I'll size up, I'll size down. Who, who looks at your label? Who? And this thing here, it doesn't actually work, this tie tassel thingy. It's just there for decorative purposes or for show or whatever. So, um, yeah, I like them so much in pink. I bought them in this charcoal grey. Again, £2.50. Again, in a size small. Um, I got them in this gorgeous blue, actually, which I do really like. Bluey, purpley, I want to say. Um, and then I bought one more pair in red. So, like I said, I do experiment out with um, colours in the summer. So, um, this I thought was a gorgeous red. Really, really pretty. They do do um, a lot more colours in those. And they're on a stand, if you want to check them out. Um, these were on a hanger. And I like these because of the colour. It's a different colour. I think you'd call it lilac. Um, different design to those um these i got in a size extra small um six to eight and these cost six pounds um so yeah quite basic again just throw on um holiday a lot of this stuff is actually for when we go away um more shorts okay so the next pair of shorts i got in an extra small and six pounds these look so darn cute on um i love these so um, they've got, if I show you closer, they look like that. They've got red and cream colouring. Um, really do like these. So I bought them in that colour. And then, of course, I bought them in another colour. Again, looks so cute on. Um, same as those ones. Extra small and cost £6. Great little basic shorts. So super job. Happy with those. The last lot of items are joggers. Um, I actually do really like Primark joggers. I know that some people, some girls don't get on with them and they prefer um, the men's joggers upstairs. I've got two different types. So the first type, oh, maybe I've got three different types. And there is a pair of trousers in there, I've just seen them. Um, this, the, these are the first pair. So they're a green. I, don't, I wouldn't say that they're a khaki, although they are a green. I'm sure there's loads of different shades of green than just calling everything that's green khaki. But anyway, um, these have got, <laughs> I'm sorry, rambling. And um, they've got pockets here. Um, and I've turned mine up like I normally do. They fit really, really well. I did initially get extra small because I've got some other ones in there that are extra small. But these are a different design. Sizing. Um, but yeah, in a small, regular fit joggers. And these want to cost £8. So... These will be great for just throwing on. They'll be great going into the autumn, winter. Am I actually talking about autumn, winter? Um, so get them while you can because these ones do sell out really, really quickly. And I think these ones are actually quite new in. So I was lucky to find those. Um, the next ones, oh, oh, I love these ones. So if you want to see or get a sense of my style, head on over to Instagram. Um, because these are of a very similar ilk to a lot of the posts that I've made um, a lot of the trousers and stuff that I've already bought from H&M and Zara and based on the kind of likes that I've got for some of the pairs that I've had on the pics that are on there um, people do really like them so these are definitely my style I got these in extra small and they cost um, £8 okay so this is what they look like 
turn the bottoms up again i'm going to throw on some trainers or flip-flops or sandals or whatever i want with these um i'll probably style them up with trainers to be honest i've just i don't know if it's gone out yet but um i've just done an unboxing of the vasia trainers i bought two pairs um and in the same video there was um the adidas sambas that i also got for my birthday so i'll probably style these up with one of those three pairs um got pockets at the front here um which is brilliant um so they're a very dark um very very dark gray bordering on black but they also do them in um khaki that is a khaki colour they did, but it was it was a wishy-washy. Um, I'd have picked those up as well, but I wasn't that keen on the colour. So really, really, really like these. So yeah, brilliant. Okay, so the next ones then are these joggers. So these ones don't have pockets. These are the skinny fit joggers. They cost £5 and I got mine in an extra small and I have been looking everywhere for these. They didn't have them or they're always out of stock in my Norwich store and when we went back to Liverpool for Easter, they had them so I grabbed them quick. So they're in this beigey, biscuity, um, I think it's beigey, biscuity colour. Um, cost a fiver. I think you've all seen these about, but again, turned up the bottoms and like I said, they've got, they've not actually got pockets here. Um, but I'm so, so happy with these. Um, these are going to be brilliant again for autumn winter. Um, so really, really happy with those. And the last pair, um, right, these are the regular fit ones. So they're similar to, I think, another pair that I showed you before, but they're a different style. Um, I got these again in extra small. They cost £5. They have pockets, um, which is brilliant. Um, turned up the bottoms as per usual for me and um, these ones will go fab with um a lot of the trainers that i've bought and i cannot wait to style these up and put them pics on insta so um yeah really really happy with these um to the point where i actually went and bought this color too um can't have enough joggers and i think the thing with joggers these days is you can really style them up and they are pretty cool um, and slouchy and comfortable and isn't that what we all like so these ones like the other ones have pockets um gray gray mall um extra small again and cost five pounds the extra small ones actually sell out really really quickly so if you do like these um and you see them pick them up quick so that is all of the clothing items. So we'll move on to the bag that's got all of the accessories. Right, so this bag then is this big, as you've already seen, and it's heavy. So I'm gonna go a bit rogue, a bit random, and do what I've not seen any YouTuber do before. And I'm just gonna tip it out. So I'm not going back and forward on things like hats and bikinis and jewelry and all that kind of stuff. So what shall we start with first? Let's do hats. So I went and bought another two hats. So this first one is for holiday and it's this. And I love these hats. I love the, the black band around them. Um, this, like I said, is for my holiday. It's for doing shoots. It's for, I don't know, protecting my face, whatever. And it looks like that. So I'll either wear it like that or like that i'm not quite sure um i quite like hats um i'm a bit of a hat wearer to be honest baseball caps or hats like these um or do a little bow peep and just do something like that but um very cute little hat so yeah i can't wait to style that up and take some pics with this on okay the next one is um a bit random so i bought the black version of this it was meant to be eight pounds and then it was reduced to three so it's this little pink number i really like this so like i said it's three pounds and i i bought this specifically for doing insta shoots for so it looks like that that is the thing about how do you wear hats do you wear them on the angle or do you wear them straight down like that who knows but i think i will probably wear mine off the face a little bit not like that probably like that a little bit but that's what it looks like um <clears throat> i really quite like this i think it's so cute i think it looks better with a tan because um if you don't know brown girls also like a tan so yeah can't wait to style 
this one up. So that's those two hats. And then I also bought my favourite. I bought a little cap. This was from the men's section. Um, and this is what this one looks like. Love that. Okay, so that one, flat hair, don't care. This one cost four pounds. Um, like I said, it's from the men's section. They've got a load of different colours in these. So if you do like it, then head over to the men's. And that is all of the hats. Okay, let's move on to flip-flops. So the last Primark haul that I did, I'd already bought some of these, but I also use these when I'm out and about in the garden a lot. So I got those ones and I got two pairs of the blue ones. As we know, these all cost 90 pence. So um, holiday in the garden, brilliant. Sorted. Okay, next pair, ah, okay, so next pair, I think you call these, are they called high tops? I don't know. But um, Converse dupe, um, as I've explained, I've also, um, well, I have just bought um, with birthday money and with um, a birthday gift. I've got new Adidas and beige trainers, so I'm not spending any more on expensive trainers. Um, I have got a pair of normal white um, red and bluey Converse ones, but I don't find them very comfortable. Um, the last Primark haul that I did, I bought the normal black and white Converse, and I wanted to get a pair of the high toppy ones, so I did. These ones cost um, £7, and I got mine in a size 7, so I flipped between a 6 and a 7, be dependent on how wide they are here. And these ones... Um, are very tight for the six here so I had to go for the seven so that's what I did I bought those these ones I've already got in black and white but I wanted a bit of color so I bought them in orange um love these they're so darn cute on and with a tan they're just gonna be beau um with shorts as well which is probably how I'll style them I got these <coughs> excuse me in a size six and they cost four quid four pounds people four pounds Cute, 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 brilliant. Right, so the next pair then are these. Now these, I think, look better on your feet than off your feet. And they were actually flying off the shelf. So I bought these ones in the Liverpool store and they do them in a number of colors and I was lucky to find these. Um, they cost six pounds and I got mine in a size six. So yeah, um, again, I think these are gonna go better with a tan, but, um, like I said, they do do them in different, do do them in different colours. So if you want to pick them up, then get them because it looks like everybody's buying them. The next ones are these. So again, similar to the black Converse dupes that I showed you. Um, I don't know if Converse do these colours, but I just liked it because it was a different kind of colour for me. Um, I bought mine in a size 6 and they cost £6, but like I said... Um, the only reason I picked these up was I just think they're different to any colour shoe trainer that I've got at the moment and um, it's quite a fun colour for me, a bit different. So yeah, really, really quite like those. Happy. These next ones um, you guys have probably seen everywhere. They've been out for quite a while. I've only just picked them up. I've only just tried them on. Um, I had a pair of navy blue jeans. Um, so a dark wash jean when I tried these on and they looked brilliant with them so um, just an easy throw on shoe a bit different to wearing the normal trainers that I wear um, I got these in a size 6 and they cost £6 which I think is a bloody good price for these so um, yeah if you like the look of these then do go pick them up um, next pair is just a standard pair of flip-flops. I wear these every year, mainly with skirts. Um, they've got a bit of a beady detail, beady? Beading detail <laughs> on them. Um, I accessorise actually do these year after year and I've picked um, a lot of these pairs up during the years after years. Um, they don't have this beading here but they are very comfortable shoes, brilliant for the beach. Um, I got mine in a size large and they only cost £3, so these ones were a very, very good buy. Okay, so that is all of the shoes, trainers, all that footwear done. The next things I'll show you are some bikinis that I picked up. Now, 
because bikinis are flying out of Primark, um, I managed to get some tops, but not a lot of bottoms. So I picked this one up and I got a size 12. So they've got this um, elastic thing going on at the bottom, but a size 10 was too tight. And at the top, I can be a size four, a size six, a size eight. I am never a size 12. Um, but obviously that's the kind of way they've designed it, the way that they've made it. I loved the color of this. Um, it cost six pounds and it's just got a little knot detail at the front. Would you say it's mocha? I think it might be a bit of a mocha color. Um, on here it says dark brown. So, um, <laughs> dark brown it is. Um, they didn't have any of the bottoms um, in my size. So, if I'm perfectly honest, I don't mind mixing and matching my bikinis on holiday. I'm not kind of like, oh, they've all gonna be the same color. Um, so, if I find them, great. If not, I'll find some other bottoms to go with these. But uh, to go with this, but um, like I said, I really love the colour of this, so I'm glad I at least got half of something. Better than nothing, isn't it? Okay, the next one is just this one. This is a string bikini. Um, loved the colour of this again. I'm not doing it justice, am I? I think it's fallen off the hanger. But um, I got this one in a size eight. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? A size eight and a size twelve. Um, and it cost two quid. Two pounds for that, so brilliant triangle, what do they call it, a triangle, triangular or a triangle bikini, it's one of those. So um, these come out year after year um, at Primark, so that was a great little buy and not too many tan lines with that either. And the next one that I bought, bottoms actually, so orange bottoms, so a little, I've got a little um, black bandeau top that'll go great with these. Um, it's got a bit of crinkle lining detail on them. I got these in a size 10, actually, um, and they cost three pounds. They do do, they do do, they do do these in um, quite a few different colors. The bandeau tops that they come with, the bikini bandeau tops, they are pretty tight. So I would definitely recommend sizing up one or two sizes because there's not one to give on these. Okay, so finally, um, we've just got a few makeup y bits, um, a few gel effect polishes. These are actually really, really good. I've got some of that Sesh Vite, that clear um, nail varnish, that once you put that on top of these, these last for ages. So I got one in that colour, which is Sweet Coral. And then I picked up this one, which is in the colour Chop Chip. So yeah, happy with those. And then they've also brought out um, some bronze glow which might be weird but I like a bit of bronzy glow myself um this one is in the color suspect and they do do they do do um quite a few different colors in these um i think different strengths of bronze um i think they've got a bit of a shimmer to them so do try out the testers to see if you like those and um, this cost two pounds and the nail varnishes cost a pound so that is not everything because we've got a couple of um, mascaras. So I think they brought out a whole new range of mascaras. This one, um, they both cost £2.50. The first one is Dramatic Lash, Volume and Length Lash Care Complex. So it's just in this silver tube, I want to say. Um, so I'll give that a go. I do use some. Um, Primark mascaras already because there are the odd ones that are really really good um, I think you've just got to try them and test them and obviously see if any of the other YouTubers um, have used them before and if they recommend them and um, this one is called fake it false lash effect extreme volume mascara and it's just in like this pinky tube um, so I will give those a go and when I do some um, vlogging I'll kind of let you know how I'm getting on with those we're done. Right then guys, so this is outfit number one. If I come closer to show you the little cropped top. So this was the four pound one. Um, really quite cropped, but I love it. Um, I paired it with the light cream joggers. Um, and if I show you the bottom, so I've turned the cuffs up and I've just put on my new beige trainers with them. 
So I actually really love um, this outfit. I'll be doing an Insta shoot of it. So um, look out for those pics. And if you're not following me on Instagram, what you doing? Head on over, I'll link it below. Um, go check out my pics. Um, all right, let's get on to the next outfit. Right, the next outfit then is the little vest top. Um, the ones I, I showed you, I bought a couple of. So this is the one with the buttons, um, size small. Um, and I paired it with these um, other black joggers that um, I showed you that were different to all of like the skinny fit and the regular ones. These ones I absolutely love. Um, I think I need to turn them up a little bit more because I'm only short. Um, if I'm looking behind you, there's a mirror. Um, so that's these, I love these, they've got pockets. Um, I've put on my, well, I've still got my Vasia trainers on, but I um, love this outfit. I probably wouldn't wear this with these, um, but I just wanted to show you because it was a whole outfit that I've already kind of shown you. So um, yeah, loving this, love how slouchy and comfy it is. That's what it looks like from the side and from behind. But um, a pretty cool outfit. So I am chuffed with this. Like I said, they do do, um, they do, do green ones in these trousers. So um, if you like them, pick them up. I was kind of not unsure. I wasn't kind of not unsure. I was kind of unsure about the colour of those. But um, it might be a pure street, so yeah, get them. But this is just such um, a neutral colour that will go with everything i think do you call black a neutral color i apparently obviously do but um yeah like i said love this outfit um so yeah let's get on to the next one right so outfit number three so this is the little cropped uh deja vu t-shirt i know i wander around a lot forgive me um but it gives you an idea of what the top the bottom and the whole look looks like um so this is the pink deja vu t-shirt as you can see it is quite cropped um and i've put it on with one of the four different pairs of shorts i showed you so this is the blue pair and i did it because that color kind of looks like this color um but yeah cute simple um easy to throw on so yeah digging this so um next one Right, for this next look then, we've got that other cropped tee that I showed you, a little knot in it. This one is almost more croppier, croppier than the other one. And if I move out, I'll just show you that I paired it with some old H&M shorts and also my Adidas Sambas um, that are new. I don't know. Um, so, yeah, not much else to say about this. A quick flick of the hair just to um kind of revamp re um voluminize because it's so flat because of the amount of recording that i've done today um but this is the look um let me know if you like it um i could style it with different colored shorts which is what i'll probably do this is a very handy t-shirt for like going for breakfast um when we go on holiday so yeah ideal bargain happy next Right, so this is the next outfit. Now, I wouldn't normally, when I do wear this, put this with this, but I've already shown you that I've bought this and this, so I've paired them together. Um, so this was just the basic little crop top. Um, I think I told you that I bought this to wear under sweat tops um, that I wear with leggings, but it's just such a cute little top. Um, and I've paired it with the um, red stripe and cream um, shorts that I bought um, again with my Adidas Sambas um, just comfy just holiday just again throw it on and you're good to go but um, this is what this little outfit looks like so let's get to the next one shall we let's go right so this is the next outfit this is a little um, pink top that I told you that I wasn't too sure about um, just because of this, but I, then I said that I did like it because it doesn't look as bad on as it did off. Did that make any sense? Um, I do actually really like it. It's such a cute little top. Um, I put it on with another pair of those, four pairs of different coloured shorts um, that I've shown you. A um, bit hard to know what to wear on the feet, so I've just put on, again, these Primark um, slip-ons. 
sliders, sandals, whatever you want to call them. Um, I'll probably tie this up because it looks stupid um, dangling down. Um, that's a little bit better. Um, but again, another cute outfit for holiday or for a very hot day when we get them in the UK. Stop fidgeting. Um, so yeah, happy with this whole look. Um, it's Primark. Love you, Primark. Um, killing it. Just killing it with the summer outfits. Um, so yeah, another one I'm really happy with. The next one. Right, so um, the last outfit then is this. So this is the black button down little tee and um, with the three dot buttons down it. Um, and I've just paired it with um, one of the million pairs of joggers that I've bought. So the olive khaki ones. Um, I put on my new other Beja V10s. Um, I'm happy. <laughs> Um, so yeah, this is it. Um, love these joggers. Um, love the fact that they've got pockets. They're a different style to um, some of the other ones that I've shown you earlier. Um, so yeah, pick these up because these ones were actually flying out. Um, they were all done. So that is everything. We are done. I know I was through a lot of that, but it's because I knew there was so much stuff. If you want to join our little group, I think I've got 26 subscribers at the moment, please do so. If you want to head over to Insta and check out my pics, please do, or please feel free to do that as well. If you are new, I do put out a couple of videos a week, um, and the more I get into it, the more I'm kind of getting used to it. Um, there's a few videos coming up for me that I've already got planned. So I've got H&M and it's going to be a joint one with Zara, so the H&M and Zara joint haul coming up. I've also got um, a kitchen tour coming up, I've got um, a few other videos lined up a week, a week, a week in outfits that one of my subscribers, Julie, um, recommended that I do, so thanks for that recommendation, Julie. But yeah, hope you've enjoyed the video, take care of yourselves, and I hope to see you in my next video. See you soon, take care, bye. Bye.